Hi, everyone. This video is going to show you how to assemble the chamber and how to use the soft oxygen chamber. Take the chamber body out and then use the air pump to inflate the air column of the chamber. The function of the air column is to support the chamber body and avoid moving. This is the looking when the air column supports the chamber. These are the connectors on chamber bodies. Now we can install the tubes between the chamber and concentrator. Just plug in the tube according to the different diameter tube. You can judge it and plug in it easily. Please be careful that the oxygen tube must connect to this one. This connector would connect the oxygen mask inside chamber. Inside users can inhale the oxygen by the mask if they want high purity oxygen. Now we can plug in the tubes for the oxygen concentrator. We will write the notes on the top of connectors. Then you can know what function for each connector. You can see there have one oxygen connector. That means the oxygen comes out from this connector. Make sure that this oxygen tube connects the connector, which can link with the oxygen mask. If you want to replug in the tube, press the ring, then take it out. It is quite easy to do. Plug in the power cord and press the power button. Now let's install the inside control panel of oxygen concentrator. Put the communication cable inside the chamber. Then screw the connector. This is the inside control panel. The Wii display is the same as outside concentrators. Did you see the white dot? Align with the white dot and plug in the connector. If you cannot see the white dots, this view will be more clear. Press the power button. The concentrator works well. You can buy foldable sofa in local and put it inside chamber. Now we connect all the tubes well. We can start the oxygen therapy. Enter the chamber and close the inner and outer zippers. Press the power button to start the machine. Turn on the machine. It will enter fast pressurization automatically. It means that it would start to inflate the chamber. You can set up the pressure at the same time. We have the real-time pressure graph and maintenance interface. You can adjust the oxygen flow. The intercom allows to speak with inside users. We can do 110 volts, 220 volts voltage based on client's requirements. Our concentrators have the air compressor function. So you can see there have no separate air compressor. 
Traditional hyperbaric chamber changes the pressure by changing the pressure relief valve like 1.1 or 1 to a 1.3 ATA. But our chamber just needs to install the max pressure valve 1.3 or 1 ATA. Then the concentrator can adjust the pressure flexible. Our concentrators use intelligent systems. When the pressure reaches required pressure, it would turn to standard pressurization automatically. Now you can choose pure oxygen mode and set up the time to start the oxygen therapy. We suggest that the therapy time needs 30 minutes at least. If you want to stop the oxygen therapy, just turn off the concentrator. This manual pressure relief valve also was called emergency valve. If emergency happens or you want to come out the chamber faster, you can handle this manual valve. But we don't suggest that you use this valve often. It is better to wait for the air leaking. Inside chamber pressure decreased gradually. It is friendly for inside users to see the panel. They can see the pressure changing and know the status. They can handle the panels too. When you see the panel shows inside pressure back to zero, you can open the zipper and come out from the chamber. Some clients want to know how to maintain the machine. When you using the chamber for 1,000 hours, the machine would remind you of replacing the filters. Take the back cover off. Then you can see the filter place. Just replace the air filters is okay. It is easy to maintain. 